Instead of hello, Missourians may soon be giving high fives. And did you know the Army Ranger recognized by President Obama is from St. Louis? Plus, super cute monkey news, that and more today in The Sift. Welcome to The Sift. I'm Gabrielle Biondo, filtering through some of the most talked about stories in St. Louis. High five. Get used to that. Because Fox 2 is reporting a bill filed in the legislature would make the high five Missouri's official greeting. Nope, not kidding. And this seems to have the potential for some awkward social situations like maybe funerals. And a big high five. Let's make it a double. For that Army Ranger who was honored by President Obama at the end of the State of the Union address. That happened this week in the St. Louis Post-Dispatch reports Sergeant First Class Corey Remsburg is a St. Louis native and a Rittner grad. Remsburg was hit by a roadside bomb in Afghanistan while on his 10th deployment and suffered a severe head injury. He received a two-minute standing ovation for his service to our country. And a high five to former Cardinal Lance Berkman, who's retiring, but also being recognized in a recent blog post for his Game 6 heroics in the 2011 World Series. In the air to right center, this game is tied. The post on Aaron Miles' fastball points out how Berkman's performance was overlooked by some, but it was key to the Cards taking Game 6. Now, the blog also asks if you could attend any game in Cardinals history what would it be? That game six is one of the top contenders. Speaking of St. Louis, the Riverfront Times reports Charlie Gito's toasted ravioli is one of 33 iconic American foods. Okay, a high five to Charlie Gito's too. Speaking of food, kind of, Purina has created a new canine energy bar. Really? Do dogs need more energy? And quarterback Eli Manning is the spokesperson for the protein and car bars for dogs. Want more on these stories? Get links to all of them right below this video. And don't forget to follow Real Time STL on Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus, and YouTube. And a high five to the St. Louis Zoo for bringing us this super cute meta moment. The zoo is celebrating the birth of this baby monkey. Now the birth is particularly significant because of the mother's age. But let's be honest, we're just showing it because this is adorable. And the music makes it even better.